Hi there. I just wanted to remind you that registration for my online masterclass for singer closes really soon. September 11th is the last day I'm taking registrations. And after that, it's going to be closed for the rest of the year. We're not going to start until next year again. So if you still want to achieve your goals and become the master of your voice, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Unless you're already perfect. I'm not sure if you are. I'm not for sure. I just actually recently recorded a video for YouTube, <laughs> a how to sing that song video, which these are highly requested and I haven't done one in a while. I just got through recording one recently and I recorded, what was it? I recorded Bridge Over Troubled Water, Paul Simon. I love that song so much. But <laughs> the funny thing was that I didn't I mean, I know the song and I have accompanied students doing it. And I thought, well, maybe I'll transpose it minus four half steps from the original. Because it's, of course, a male singer and I have to transpose it down um, or actually up. So I transposed it and I started, you know, the video and I was teaching and teaching and showing what to do. And then I got into the last high part and I hadn't even tried it out. Dumb. I was so dumb. I hadn't even tried out the end part when it goes really hard, if that's, you know, the right key for me. And it turned out to be just a little too high, maybe like two half steps too high. I should have transposed down more. And so I was like, whoops, okay, see, I'm not perfect. It is just a little too high for me. Can't quite swing it. Maybe I need to transpose it. So, but I just love keeping it real and authentic and raw because that's just how it is. And the process of just really tweaking things and finding your voice in a song and finding how, you know, what works for you, what's best. Um, that's just a process that I would love to share. And that's why I just didn't edit that. And I left it in there because I think it's valuable. By the way, I have a video on YouTube. Um, even professional singers suck watch me practice. So maybe you want to watch that. I just show you how I practice something and I just doesn't work. You know, it just doesn't work. I break and I try to figure out how to do it. And uh, just going through the process of tweaking, of experimenting, trying out different approaches, maybe more. It was like this high belted part in one of the Dream Girls songs. And I just couldn't get it for the life of me. And it only worked when I mixed it. When I really went into like very much mixed voice, staying very light on the top, not pushing too much heavy mechanism, and then it worked out. So my question for you is, are you ready to change? There's still time. What are you waiting for? Are you waiting for something just to happen and maybe magically tomorrow you will wake up and your voice will be clear and you will have full control? I don't know how likely that is. I mean, I feel like I'm pretty much in control, but even then, you know, there's there's always something I can tweak. And believe me, I don't just work on my own. I have so much input around me all the time with my gigs, and I have conductors, I have colleagues, I have other musicians constantly giving me feedback on what's good and what I can still tweak. So it's really important to always being held accountable and to always have something like a goal to work towards. Because if you just don't have any goal of like somebody is giving me an assignment or you have maybe like, okay, by November 1st, I want to have this one song nailed down so I can record it in a studio. If you don't have goals nailed down, it's like you're not going to do the work. I know me. I'm just by nature. I'm not really. I'm, I'm kind of lazy. I admit so, but the most important thing is just you got to be held accountable. And what are you waiting for? If singing really means so much to you, and if you really want to, if you really want to know once and for all, what direction is it that I need to take? And how do I turn this into something that I can truly use, whether it's singing a solo in church in front of everyone, or recording your own songs or recording cover songs, maybe you want to start a YouTube channel and start performing songs, but you're scared. All of those things I can help you with because I have experience in all of these areas. I have experience in music videos, music recordings, live PA setup and what you need, how to get gigs, all the vocal techniques of a lot of different styles. Uh, now, I don't do like, I don't know, like the growling, shouting, rough kind of type sounds. I don't do that. But 
if you're doing pop, rock, uh, musical theater, jazz, folk, soul, gospel, classical, opera, all of those genres, I can absolutely help you with because I have performed for decades in most of these professionally. So um, I really have a lot to share. If you are interested, like you got to act quickly. Registration starts September 11th. Yeah, there's going to be a bomb if you don't join. Just kidding. So if you have not decided and you are on the fence, this is the last chance this year to get into an online format where you could just do it from home, from your comfort. But you are for sure, I'm going to promise that, you're going to be taken out of your comfort zone and I want you to do things that are not comfortable. So you are pushed to do new things you never thought were possible. Okay, that's all for today. You have a wonderful day and I do hope to see you on the inside. Have a great day and always keep a song in your heart. Bye.